Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Megan here and I'm going to do the Scarlet Lime Planner Society May Kit unboxing. Um, I will let you know I do have my baby with me. He is cranky cranky. He did not sleep too well last night. So if we have any stoppage, I will press pause and take care of that so you don't have to listen to it. So let's jump right in. Um, I get the Planner Society kit, the box sticker kit, and the washi kit add-on. So we'll start with the box sticker kit. Here is the bag it came in. Pretty palm trees. And then here are those stickers. So we will start with the deco, the girls, the planner girls. She is super pretty. I wish I could get it to focus for you. I'm so sorry about this. There it goes. And her beautiful little dress with all the different patterns for this month. And then the telephone, which is a repeating item, the planner, and the cactuses. So there's that one. There is, there's the actual box stickers. Sweet to do couple of stickers that are just full box pattern and a couple of stickers with one with planner girl and one with some cactuses and here are our functional stickers today's to do's icons hearts and checklists and here are our full box checklists again the little clipboards super adorable and finally we have our washi tape our quarter box appointment boxes and our half box stickers so pretty 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 so that is the full box um, sticker kit I also get the washi kit so here's the bag that the washi kit came in and these are add-ons so you purchase the kit and you you go and look at our website but you purchase the kit up until the 15th from the beginning up until the 15th of the month you can you can purchase the kit and you have to have at least a three month subscription so just be cognizant of that if you're going to do this um, I gotta say like when I'm watching her on Instagram and she's putting up the full box reveals and the sneak peeks and stuff sometimes I'm a little questionable but this is my second month of this and these kits are amazing the colors are beautiful the quality is there so um, if you if you're not quite sure if it's something that you know you want to invest in I can tell you right now that I am so glad that I did invest in it and I plan to stay uh, with the planner society and as a planner girl a TPS planner girl for quite a while so um, the washi kit okay so these are the washies that came in the washi kit this month we have the flamingos with the little black hearts super cute we have the cactus pretty pretty green cactus still doesn't want to do it anyway so they're they're super cute they're a little small scale but they're they will make great background for uh, half box and full box in my planner and then the pink with palm trees also super duper cute so those are the three washi that came in the washi kit add-on and let's set those right there like that before they roll away okay so on to the regular kit this is the bag that the kit came in um, it shows you all the colors for this month's kit with this chartreuse this lilac two tones of gray two tones of green actually three shades of green in there a um, couple shades of pink some uh, obviously the green and the pink and the chartreuse are kind of the dominant colors and stuff but this floral is amazing spectacular beautiful um, I know last month the bag that everything came in I used quite a bit and I can tell you right now by looking at this bag that I will be using it a lot too the other thing I like about these bags is you can hardly see it but because the you can't see the seam really because they pattern match it so well so um, really nice quality and I used one of the little tricks that I found on YouTube I think to get this sticker off in there now this is a high quality um, vinyl sticker it's meant to keep the bag closed so it is a very high quality sticker and it tends to rip and leave residue and I've seen people use undo to get those off of there um, I do not own undo so I use a hair dryer heated the sticker up to the point where um, the, the glue kind of released and I could pull it off of there a little bit easier there is a little bit of sticky residue right here where it was I'm not too concerned about that 
uh, because I did not rip the paper in the bag, <laughs> which is the whole point of doing that stuff. So. So here's the bag that the kit came in. Like I said, beautiful bag, high quality paper on all of the bags that she uses in the kit. So here is one of the washi rolls that comes in the kit. It is the green floral on a pink background. It's a little tough to see the definition, but um, when you get close up to it in person, it's just spectacular and the definition is definitely there. So that came in the kit. And then the other washi that came in the kit is this one. Let's see if I can get it to focus on her. Come on, please. Come on. Oh, this is so frustrating. There it is. The planner girl with her pretty little green foam dress, her pink bow, and her adorable heart sunglasses. And those little shoes with the ties on them. So cute. So this washi came in the kit. The other three, like I said, were the washi add-on. Also in the kit, the stickers that come in the kit. Uh, this bag, teal, with pink flamingos and pink palm trees. And in here, we have the little planner girl sayings. We have the planner girl. Tiny, tiny stickers. This super cute. I love this dress right here. I'm going to make this dress right here. Adorable. That's going to be on me by the end of the summer. And then we have some more deco. Pink palm trees. Who doesn't love pink palm trees? Some functionals. Some more deco. And at last, some more deco. Again, this car. This car. Who doesn't want that car? I want that car, and I want these flamingo inner tubes. They are adorable. Stickers are so cute. Good job on those stickers. All right, so last month in the kit, we got sequins, and the intention that I think a lot of people did was to make shaker cards. So this month, we got the actual shaker card, um, which I I appreciate this more. I, I'm okay with shaker cards. They're not my favorite. Sequins, in my opinion, are it's like glitter. It's just a mess. Um... So this is the this is the pack they all came in. That's the backer card in there. And here are the shaker cards. And you can see there's there's little flamingo sequins in there. There is little flowers. And then there's just regular sequins in there. So this one says, you got this, sweet girl. This one says, you do you. Do, 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 do. And they're stitched down really well, and it's it's that's that's a nice quality plastic on the front, so acetate on the front. And then these two, they're not shaker cards. They um they have you can see it there. They have a pocket in them. You can see that pocket. So you'd be able to like if you had a clip, you could clip it on there. Um, if you had you know some stickers, you could stick it on there. Like, I'm sure people are going to make uh, washi cards to put some washi around to, so they have the washi in their planner on the go. Um, you could stick a, a washi card down in there with all the different washies. But, so yeah, they, these two came in the kit. Um, none of these are backed. They're all blank back. Um, so what I think I'll probably end up doing is using some of the bags and putting putting backs on these. So that I can just, you know, I don't know. I don't know what I'm going to do with these yet. These these cards have me a little bit stumped. These, I mean, they're a little more self-explanatory. It's kind of like, oh, you know what to do with shaker card. But these these two cards have me a little bit stumped. So we will see. I'll figure something out there. I appreciate that they're pre-made. I don't have to make shaker cards. Because um, I still, to be honest with you, I still have that entire entire tube of uh, sequins and glitter from the uh, April kit. Um, upstairs. I just haven't done anything with it. But. Okay, so also in this kit are the tabs. And this is this is standard fare. These come, in my opinion, or not in my opinion, what I've seen, these come in every kit. So again, there's a beautiful backer card. Here are all of the tab stickers. And you know these these are apparently 
Somebody said that this is Chrissy's handwriting, and if that's the case, oh my goodness, her handwriting is beautiful. I wish my handwriting was this good. Um, she either must really, really practice a lot, or this is just, she's, she's a lucky, lucky girl. So there are those, and then here are the actual tabs. So you would, you'd fold them in half and put your glue in there, and then put your, uh, put your tab on your divider, and put your little label on the tab. These are the patterns. Some of these are different colorways, like there's that lilac with a little bit of the blue. Um, this this is not like a whole sheet pattern anywhere, but these are the, the patterns and the colors from the kit. They're just sort of in different, I don't know, just sort of, it's they're different, but they're the same, if that makes sense to you, because they, they go with the kit, but they're not, they're not like, like that's not in the kit anywhere predominantly. So, but there are the dividers. Um, Let's see here. Oh, so like when I was opening the bags, I managed to save three stickers. I've got two of these off of the washi rolls, and then this one says the Washi Tape Society. And this is just a little bit of wax paper, and I was like, I, I don't know. I geeked out. I was like, yay, I saved the stickers. So, which I probably won't ever use, but whatever. Um, so this, these are sticky note. Like, this little planner girl is a sticky note. She's in there, super cute, and you have room to write on her skirt there. Her, it almost looked like an apron. She's super cute. And let's see here. Here is the other planner girl. So this one is a stamp. She's a clear stamp. Um, whoops, baby, what are you doing? So there's the backer card. Here is the stamp. Um, she does not have the little heart-shaped sunglasses, but she's still super cute, and I really like her still. I like the stamp. It's a good deal. Um, let's see here. We'll just set her right there, I guess. Yeah, you cannot even see her. I'll set her right there like that. Whoa, whoa. On top of that. Whoa, whoa, whoa. All right, so we get a planner bow. Whoa, whoa. The backer card. Here's the bow. And it's got this little piece in it. And what you could do is I mean it's got a lobster lobster claw clasp right there. You can you can loop that around the ring in your planner so that it hangs out. Or you can just put this like if you're using a TN. I know a lot of people put this on the front of their TN. I have not really played with these a whole lot because I, I don't know, like my planner, is, it's got a fit in my purse and if it's got danglies and stuff like that on it, then when I, when I pull it out of my purse, it, it can catch and rip and just cause a mess. So I don't, I don't necessarily use these much, but, um, I don't know. Then again, I've never owned one, so maybe I will. Alrighty. So keep going with the planner girl theme here. This is... The paper clip. Isn't she super cute? Now, the clip is here, so what you see is what you see in your planner, which I really appreciate being able to just look at it and see what I'm going to see in the planner. Sorry. Little boy, can you go play near the room for just a minute, please? All right. So there's the planner girl paper clip. Set her right there. Here is. Uh oh. Uh oh. Hold on. Hold on. All right. Sorry about that interruption. Um, this is the pin that came. Oh, my goodness. All right. One more time here. Give this a try. Here is the pin that came with the kit. It is a ballpoint pen. It's it's pretty. It writes well. Um, it's a black ink. It's got that beautiful crystal up there on the top. Um, this is the first pen like this that I've ever owned. I've thought about buying them a couple times. I've seen them a number of times. I've never picked one up. And this month, got one in the kit. So that's pretty cool. Set that right there. Um, let's see here. These are the die cuts. This month, the die cuts are a little bit, I don't know if I'd say, I don't know. It feels like they're printed on a different paper this month. That they're not as robust as they were last month, but there is a lot of them. Uh, so there's the backer card that they came on with, whatever. So some of these say 
Beach Babe. You got the telephone. You got the cactus. You've got these adorable inner tubes. And this, these pineapples, you can't you probably can't see that very well, but those are eyelashes. How clever is that? So there's the inner tubes, the flamingo inner tubes. There's a couple of the planners. Um, here's these little thistles, I guess. Some more words and whatnot. Some more cactuses, some doors. Uh, happy planning. Some more chairs. Love those chairs. Cactuses. This one says Planner Society Girl, and I will say yes, I am. There's another flamingo. And some more words. And a cup of pencils. Go right there with the planners. And then there's a lot of these little planner girls in here. Again, this dress. This, this whole dress, I want this dress. I want to make this dress for myself. It'll complete with this with this little chartreuse top. And it's almost like kimono-esque. It's so, so cute. But so then you get four of the little planner girls. And those are, like I said, those are all die cuts. And then we have this came in here. These are puffy stickers. There's 16 of them. Oh, come on. I think... I'm not sure, but I think these were made, they, they were designed by somebody else to go with this kit. I can't remember what Christy said on her Insta story, but so the backer card says, let's plan at the beach. And then there are those stickers. And like I said, they're puffy stickers, but they have a matte finish to them. And um, they're super cute. Yeah. Make a dashboard or something with those. Super duper cute. Let's just set them right here, I guess. Alrighty, hold on. I'm so very sorry about all the interruptions this month. My my baby did not sleep well last night and he is having a really, really, really bad morning. So, alright, let's get to the papers. Finishing up real quick. So, these are the papers that came this month. We've got flamingos with palm trees backed with palm fronds. We have got palm trees on blue, backed with that great chartreuse dash print. We have got this amazing floral, backed with cactuses. This, this right here, this is the money shot right there. Um, and then we got another set of those, those two, and what they're back with. So, also this month. In this kit were a number of specialty papers. So let me get through these super duper quick. We have two vellums, so the palm tree vellum and the um, floral vellum. See that there? Very pretty vellums. And then there was two acetates. So we have flamingos. And again, this, this paper, it adds a dimension, but it's easier to see that way. And I don't have any white paper with me right now. And then we have the piece de resistance, the planner girl. Again, acetate. These are acetate backgrounds. Oh, that's hard to see here. <laughs> Let's just do this. So, yeah. So that is it for the May Planner Society kit. Um... So you can see, you know, I mean, there's a lot of good stuff in this kit, as there is, uh, has been, at least for me, over the last two months. Each month they've gotten um, good stuff in the kit. And plenty of supplies here to completely outfit your planner, your traveler's notebook, you know, to make inserts, to, I don't know. It's just, there's so much here. There's just so much here. So... Um, if you stayed with me for the whole video, I thank you so, so much. And I am so, so sorry about all of the interruptions and stoppages. Um, if you have any comments or suggestions, I really do appreciate them. And otherwise, I will see you next time. All right. Bye-bye, you guys.